Taylor. I'm reporting for community service. Oh, sure. We've been expecting you. Um, the office manager had to step out for a second, but you can place your things right over there. Okay, thanks. Mm -hmm. Hundred hours. That's not too bad. Well, I'm glad you think so. <laughs> It'll fly by. You'll see. I guess. So, what would you like for me to do first? Well, you, you can first start by unclogging the toilets. Excuse me. And then you can go around back and take out the garbage from last Friday. Oh, you know what? There must be some confusion. I was told that this was an administrative assignment. But that's okay. I'll just wait for the office manager to come in. Oh, you mean Rochelle? You didn't get my email? What email? <laughs> I must have forgot to send it to you. Rochelle is no longer the office manager here. I am. So for the next 400 hours, you will do what I tell you to do. The bathrooms are this way. through this baby just, just talk to me please leave me alone Andre baby just say something I said leave me alone baby it, it feels like I'm losing you just 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 talk to me please damn it Andre <sighs> I said leave me alone shit Where's my purse? What? My purse. It was right here. It's missing. I had it I, yesterday. I it was right here. Where is today? And it's missing. Where? Where? Where's my purse? I haven't, I haven't seen any purse around it. What, what are you looking for? It was for? right there. Where's the purse? <sighs> Do you? Do you want a divorce? All I want is for you to leave me alone. Okay. Okay. Wait, hold, hold on a second. You know, we, we can't go through this any longer. This isn't good for either one of us. So we can either get through this together or we can just be better off apart. I can't live like this. Hello? Where are you? Hey! 
What's wrong? Andrew and I kissed. What? When? The other night. I was supposed to went to the park and met him. I changed my mind. He showed up at the house. We got into an argument and we kissed. Did you tell Julian? No, I'm telling you. Sean, you have to tell Julian. And ruin my wedding? Uh, no. If you don't tell Julian and he figures it out, you won't have to worry about it because there won't be a wedding. I don't have feelings for Andrew. I love Julian. Sean, I love you. So please don't take offense to this, but you have feelings for Andrew and it's okay. What are you talking about? I don't have feelings for Andrew. I love Julian. Okay, if you love Julian, then tell him what's going on then. I don't even think that he would even Um, excuse me. There's only one lunch break in the day and you already took it. So I suggest you get back to work. Uh, what is she doing here? It's a long story. This shredder isn't going to empty itself. Okay, Desiree, I'll be there in a minute. Then get to stepping. Sean, look, I have to go, but can you please just think about what I said? You need to tell Julie. All right, I'll tell him. Because we all know what happens when you keep secrets. Okay, I'll tell him. Hey, it's me. I need to talk to you. When will you be back? All right, I'll talk to you then. Alexis? Change for Jesus? Really, Nancy? Has it come to that? It's for a worthy cause. I'm sure it is. But what's the scheme? Come on. There's got to be something in it for you. No, there no? is no scheme. I finally found my calling. Oh, come, Nancy, you and I both know what your true calling is. And panhandling for Jesus, isn't it? I know you find this hard to believe. But I'm a changed woman now. I had such high hopes for you. It's very hard to find a whore of your caliber. And it's a shame, really, because I thought you'd be a fantastic replacement for Dominique. Dominique? Where is she going? When you decide to take a detour on your walk with Jesus, you call me. Oh. nothing. Next time. I don't think this is a good idea. Will you tell me what you think we should do then? I mean, everybody's turning their fucking backs on us. Do you understand that? We are out here alone. We're alone because we're the only two here. Duh. Boo, listen to me. We're running out of money. None of these motherfuckers out here touch any of our holes. And on top of that, I got motherfuckers back at home asking me questions about Jack all of a sudden. Do you think this shit is a coincidence? This ain't no fucking coincidence. What else is it? Follow the fucking bouncing ball. That bitch Dominique put the world out on us. She fucking blackballed us, man. But why would she do that? I'll tell you what, let's sit here and be quiet, okay? Let's just sit here and not fucking say anything. Let's sit here in complete fucking silence. Can you do that? Is that okay with you? Fuck. Oh, is that dude? It, it, that's, I think, that, is that dude right there? Cherry! What? I thought you said you wanted to sit in silence. Yeah, that's him. Simple fucking question. (laughs) 
So I hear you the dude that's supposed to help us with our problems. Trust me, there's nothing more I love to do. Let's get it. Hey, Jennifer. Glad I caught up with you. Really? Why? Well, I need you to sign this petition. You know, we need to get together in the community and do what's right. This is against Nicole and Andre. Look, Mia, I know they're your friends, but I ain't gonna sign this. Mia! We cannot have these kind of people in our neighborhood! What do you mean by these kind of people? You know! Child killers! Jennifer, that was an accident. Some of us don't believe that. Well, then some of you need to mind your own damn business. What do you do in your spare time? You just sit around and poke yourself into other people's lives and then create petitions against them? <laughs> you know what? I should have known better than to come to you. You're no different from them. Everyone knows that you're the reason your husband's pushing up daisies. Now create a petition about that. What are you doing with this shit? I don't need a lecture, Chauncey. No, you need your ass kicked for thinking about going back on this shit again. But you don't understand. Hey, I get it. Andre fucked up. He lied. He embarrassed you. He humiliated you. But you don't solve one problem by starting another. I just don't know what to do at this point. Hey, you know I'm not the man's biggest fan. But one thing that's really obvious is that he loves you. As much as I hate to admit it, you love him too. Reese, go home to your husband and work it out. Yeah, give me the number for the uh, Washington Examiner. Yeah, Celebrity News Department. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, babe, you ready? Oh, you have no idea. Excuse me. I I've done everything on the list, and I just need you to... Fill out my form with my hours. Well, 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 look at that. Only 392 more hours to go. And I look forward to it because the first eight were just so enjoyable. Mm. person with my car. <coughs> Wait, what? It's so not important. Okay. So. Uh, so, uh, what? The other night. It was nice. What happened the other night? <coughs> Ow. Talk about an ego killer. I'm just teasing. Of course it was nice. So, I was just wondering if it would be okay to... Scott, let's just go and get your stuff. 
Come no. home. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Well, I was just gonna ask if it would be okay to have a repeat of the other night, but I'm cool with that too. I've so missed you. I have no idea how long I've been waiting for you to say that. Martin, thank you for meeting me on such short notice. My pleasure. How can I assist you? I know you're used to receiving services from my company, but this time I require yours. So what do you need? Cliff. Hmm. I need everything you can find on her. Everything. If she's got a parking ticket, I want it. Sure, it might take a couple weeks, but I'll get it on ASAP for you. ASAP? Mm hmm Why are you still standing here? I'll be in touch. Good. I'll be waiting. Bye, detectives. Can you trust this guy? I mean, we're about to get into some heavy shit. Cliff. Martin has been a loyal client for eight years. If there's anybody can trust, it's him. Dominique, hmm. I don't know. I'm saying, Alexis got people all over this town. We make one false move? I don't know. How long have you been with me, Cliff? For a very long time. And have I ever led you down the wrong path? No. Right. And I'm not about to start now. Everybody has weaknesses, okay? Including Alexis Jordan. All we have to do is find it and exploit it, okay? And besides, everybody knows in Anacostia there can only be one head bitch in charge. And that's me. <laughs> You're right about that. Okay. They're gonna learn today. All right, let's go. Did. Are you serious? Very. So what did she do? Well, she didn't do anything. She kind of just stood there. <laughs> Shit, I would have too. It's not <laughs> funny. I am not proud of what I did. You know what? Tomorrow I'm going to apologize to her. Mm -mm. Um, well, I'd give it a few days. You think so? Sweetie, if you slap the taste out of my mouth, I don't think I would want to see you for a good month or two. Email? Email. Okay, that's what I'll do. You know, I can't believe I went off on her like that. You know, it's not like me at all. Just a second. Hello? Yes, this is Mia Stevenson. Yes, I understand. 10 a.m. is fine. Okay. Thank you. Bye. 
Who's that, Jennifer looking for a rematch? The results are in from my biopsy. 